Well, hello again, everybody. Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Fallout 76. It's been a while since I last played this game. Uh, this is the first time I have played it since uh, I went home to visit my family for Christmas. And uh, we're in a location that um, you're not familiar with yet, and I'm going to explain it here in a minute, but I want to shoot this legendary dude first. Uh, and then we'll talk for a bit, but I just noticed that this guy was here. And uh, he is, uh, he's putting up a fight. Okay, we got him. Okay, so we, we killed the legendary dude. So I, I wanted to go ahead and kill him before somebody else killed him, and then I didn't get credit. Oh, this place is kind of crazy. Uh, cho cloaking forest scout armor right arm. Well, as you can imagine, I'm pretty n not very excited about that. Um, it's two stars, but not too crazy about it. Let me clear these guys out. And like I said, then we'll talk. I can't get him through that fence, I guess. Oh, so shooting somebody off in the distance there, apparently. Anybody else? Still says caution. Yep, there's somebody over there. Okay. Lots of craziness going on here. Pretty crazy. Did not anticipate this craziness. Okay, I think... I think maybe we're okay now. Whoa, what's that? <laughs> so, where are we on the map, you may be wondering. Well... Um, that's a fair question. Absolutely. You can see over there, that place should look familiar. We are just outside of Watoga, and we are at a place called NAR Repair Yard. And why am I here? Well, let me see if I can explain this. Um, remember when we went to Vault 79 a couple episodes ago, and uh, we went inside of, not Vault 79 itself, but the exterior of it, and we kind of explored it, and it was all part of that pawn shop craziness right um and i visited the exterior of vault 79 and i looked around and in the episode that you guys watched um after i looked around in vault 79 i went back to uh grafton pawn shop and did a little bit more uh research on uh, what was up on that chalkboard uh that was an edit that you probably maybe didn't notice uh what really happened after i uh, visited fault 79 i was like well i don't know what else to do now and so what i did was i traveled uh to watoga and uh i walked south to this place called sunrise field uh this was a place that uh, we hadn't discovered yet or hadn't explored yet it was gray on the map and uh so i walked down here and looked at this and um then I walked in this direction and walked over here to NAR Repair Yard. And that was stuff that I did. And then after I did it, I thought, oh, wait a minute. I want to go back to Grafton Pawn Shop. So anyway, I did some editing and what happened happened. And here's where I am now. So what I'm going to do now is um, I'm going to uh, go back. I'm going to go back to where I started in Watoga Station and, 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 uh, uh, I know I'm not explaining this very well. <laughs> I, I'm going to go back to Watoga Station, uh, my recording from before, and share with you guys my walk from Watoga Station to Sunrise Field and all the stuff that happened here and all the stuff that happened between here and uh, the NAR repair yard. And then, after you see that, uh, we will resume here at the NAR repair yard. So, let's go back in time a little bit. And then I will meet back up with you guys here at NAR Repair Yard. Okay, we are going to go in this direction here. Let's go. There's the uh, blast zone there. It's pretty cool looking, really. I guess I don't need to run. Uh, this is probably a part of the map that we haven't explored before. So uh, let's kind of slow down a little bit. Check it out. Oh, doggone, did I press jump? Oh, I probably couldn't have made that jump anyway. So there's some buildings here, but these are not the buildings on my map. I'm trying to decide if these look familiar or not. If I'd been here already, I don't know. 
but I mean, does this count as an unmarked location? Oh, this is Sunrise Field. What the hell's going on? How come my compass isn't showing this location? You know what I'm saying? That doesn't make any sense. Why? Why did this not show up on my compass? Ooh. A Mirelurk Deep King. Oh, yeah. You just stay over there, Mirelurks. Or over there. Just stay far away. Stout Shell Mirelurk. Are these new Mirelurks? I don't remember some of these. I love that my vats can see through weeds. <laughs> Freaking awesome. In that direction are railroad tracks. That's something I don't have on my map. I don't understand why I'm not seeing Sunrise Field on my compass. Is it because I've got my marker in the way? I've never seen that happen before. No. This is weird, man. What's going on? But in that direction are railroad tracks that I do not see on the compass. So, beats the hell out of me, man. I don't know what's going on. How's it going, man? You doing all right? Hmm. A lot of boxes here. There's a dude back here. He just drank himself to death, I guess. Fusion cells. I could sell those. A Tesla rifle. I don't know. Tesla rifle. Let's take a look at it. Not real familiar with the Tesla rifle. Level 50 Tesla rifle. It does a lot of damage, but I'm not specced for this thing. At all. Um, and it's heavy, so I will be scrapping it. Alright, well here's a barn. Turn off my light. I did not need to alert the Mirelurks to my location. Couple structures over there. We got a house and a garage over here. Gosh, that's really cool looking from here, isn't it? It's pretty neat. Where's that deep dude that I killed? Over here. What do you got on you? Some caps and some meat? Let me uh, harvest your meat so it can spoil in my inventory instead of on the ground there. It's a great idea, right? I think so. There's murky water here. It's a big house, huh? Oh. Diseased glowing Mirelurk right there, man. I did not even see him. Apparently it's the Mirelurk that you can kill forever. And it will never die. Look at that. He gets his health back. Alright, go figure. Can I not get in this way? So, here's what I'm thinking. This, this farmhouse was here, right? Had all this land. Beautiful view of the mountains. Sitting out here. And then they came in and built Watoga. Now that's right outside their front door. Of course, it doesn't really matter now. Ain't nobody living here now. Rat poison, yes, please. Recipe for Mega Sloth Tenderloin. Okay, well, that's something new. We hadn't had that one. Had, haven't learned that one yet. Old telephone here. Um, well... Um... Oh, there are stairs here. Okay, cool. I was going to say, I thought I saw st uh, a second floor. But there, and there is one. Cool. Tatted rags, some vegetable starch. 
better, uh... I can't grab that pillow. <laughs> that pillow is unobtainable. This is it? This is the hole? Okay, we've gotten in here yet. What the hell? Hmm. Died in the shower there. Sad baby crib there. Yeah, yeah I saw it. It's just a dumb safe. Is there really ever anything interesting in these safes? Oh, come on. Uh, I don't want the shish kebab. Or the grenades. I'll take the other stuff, though. Oh, oh, oh. I can't have that under the pillow. <laughs> Almost forgot, man. All right, well, there you go. That's what's going on in this place. Pretty exciting. What's this place called again? Sunrise Field. Okay. And then, um... Over in that direction, there's some structures. Let's go check these out. Keep an eye out for Mirelarks or other nasties. It's very boggy here. Extremely boggy. There's a tractor down in that marsh. So, I, get, I think this part of the map is called Cranberry Bog, right? Um, are cranberries grown in West Virginia? I've never really thought about it before, but uh, they have a whole place called Cranberry Bog, so I, I imagine cranberries are grown in West Virginia. Don't know why they would call a place Cranberry Bog in the game if there's no cranberries in West Virginia. This big old flower here. Um, fine. A silver locket and a gold fork. a bunch of crap for us to pick up man that's it who lived here what did they do where did they there where did they go no idea we may never know ever oh now it's showing up <laughs> now it's showing up on my compass that's weird so in this direction we've got a place called lost home and then well i don't see it now but a while back, there was a railroad um, sign, railroad indicator on my compass, but I'm not seeing it now, so I'm thinking that maybe there isn't a railroad, and my compass was just messed up. Yep, yeah, sure enough, I mean, not seeing that railroad marker anymore. Should have walked there when I could have. Well, let's walk over here to Lost Home. Oh, the railroad marker is back. Huh. Look at this. There's like a dam here. Huh. Guess this is how they would dam up the water so that they could make their cranberry bogs, I guess. I don't know. I don't know anything about it. So instead of walking towards the railroad crossing marker on my compass because that is not something I already have marked on the map whereas this lost home is something I have marked on the map so let's go towards something that I don't have marked on the map yet how's that sound I think it sounds pretty good it's a good strategy good strategy 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 for what I don't know don't ask me questions all right let's 
So this lost home, this other, this weirdness is happening again. Where, um... We're pretty close to this place called Lost Home, I feel like. And, uh, this is probably the railroad thing. Lost Home is not showing up on my... And now the railroad thing's gone again. What the hell's going on? I don't know what's going on, man. I hope you see, have seen what I'm talking about. So I'm not alone in this. I just saw something. Oh. Am I crouched? Yeah. Those things... Historically, have historically had a lot of trouble with in this game, but... Now with this freaking awesome weapon, not so much anymore. What is that right there? Look. Somebody on fire? What is that? Oh, it's a flaming, like, Mr. Handy. Look. Look at that. <laughs> Being chased by something, I can't quite tell what. A cave cricket? I'm not close enough to... Oh, Colonel Gutsy. Level 52. And a cave cricket piercer. Battle of the century going on right here. Oh, and he, down he goes! Colonel Gutsy is down! No, he's not. <laughs> That's kind of neat. They're a long way away, man. So, that railroad crossing has disappeared again. Don't know what the hell's going on. Game can't decide what it's going to do. Oh, the, it's back! <laughs> Look, it's back now! I hope you know what I'm talking about. Bottom center of the screen, my compass, there is, right in the center of it, there is what appears to be railroad crossing sign. And it's there for a moment, and then it disappears. Oh, it's gone! It's disappeared again. It's back! The game can't decide what to do with itself today. Well, let's explore this place while we're here. We found ourselves a weapons workbench. I really don't need to be picking this stuff up, man. But look at me, picking it up. I think you'd be disappointed if you tuned in and I didn't pick things up. Just, um... Just a little hut here, the remains of a house. Not a whole lot left here. Not a whole lot. Lure weed. Somehow this house has ended right up on top of one of these washouts. I don't know what those are. All over the place over here. I think I hear something. Maybe it's just the water making noise. Well, Vats isn't picking up on anything. The railroad thing is back. I still don't see this lost home on my compass. And uh, according to this, we still have a ways to go to get to lost home. But like I said, I'm going to try to get to this railroad thing. I really don't like walking around down in there, but... At least it's not wet. It's muddy, but... It's not wet. It's very quiet out here. It's gone again. Dog on it. Now, it's showing up as, uh... This symbol. Which, I've been to Big Ben Tunnel before. So, I don't know what's going on today. So, instead, let's see if we can't find this place called Lost Home. So, yeah, there's something something weird with the compass going on today. Server woes, I don't know. Well. Yeah. 
Here we've got a suitcase just lying here. This guy was like, my suitcase! My note and toy truck notes. In order to rebuild this great state, we need to distribute armor to known survival sediments. Take one set of leather right leg to Lucky Hole Mine and don't die. Find out how many more they want, then we can try to equip them. We need everyone on our side. The hell? Okay. Take one set of leather right leg to Lucky Hole Mine and don't die. Find out how many more they want, then we could try to equip them. Well, it's too bad that didn't kick off a quest. That would have been kind of neat. <laughs> wow. Interesting. Now I've got a star and a circle showing up on my compass. And there's no star and circle out here in this direction, so... There's one over here. There's one up here. That railroad symbol that we saw, does that symbol exist anywhere else in the game? I guess it does, doesn't it? But I don't know where. This whole thing is weird. Okay, now the house has shown up. The house symbol has shown up on my compass. Now there's the railroad thing. It's back. I'm going to it, man. I'm going to it. We're going to get this to show up, damn it. I like that there's bridges here I can walk across. That's nice. Keep an eye on that railroad symbol. We don't want it disappearing on us again. Keep an eye on it. Sentry bot hostile detected non-combatant safety combatant safety something or other. And in that direction is a is a door with um a quest involved. Oh look, th I didn't notice that miscellaneous quests show up up there. Recover the item from the lucky hole mine. Huh. But That's Big Ben Tunnel East. Oh, Lucky Hole Mine is way over here. Hi, right, this is bizarre, man. So suddenly there were explosions here. There was a sentry bot. Don't know if anything survived. It did not. I saw something walk over here. I saw it. No! <laughs> no! We've discovered the NAR repair yard, and I've leveled up. Oh yes, killing super mutant overlords in one shot. Gosh, I love it. I don't want any of that crap. I mean, I guess I could sell 5mm rounds. Sure, I'll take those. They don't weigh that much, I don't think. Don't want that. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not going to get anything for that guy because I did not kill him. Well, it is um, like a, a hut of sorts. So this is, I guess, where they would repair their trains, maybe. Um, I don't want any of that crap. Anything behind the door? I can't even move that door. Okay, never mind. And then we've got a house over here. And I guess a Big Bend Tunnel East. Kind of weird to me that there is a uh, 
road sign on train tracks. But we've been in Big Bend Tunnel on both sides, the east side and the west side. We've been both places. It was pretty cool. See if there's anything interesting in this house. How's it going? Mind if I come in? Well, I'll take your purified water and ragstag rad stag meat. It's hard to say. A footlocker. Ooh, a level three skill footlocker. I hate these. <laughs> Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that great stuff inside of there. Ooh, boy. That's so worth it. So worth it. Well, in that direction is Lost Home. And um, I'm not going to go recover that item from Lucky Hole Mine. And um, I thought there was another thing showing up here. Maybe, maybe not. doghouse here <laughs> okay dude <laughs> trying to climb in the doghouse well you know maybe he was being attached by scorch beasts and uh, he was trying to get away from him hide in the doghouse okay so here we are back uh, now you know how I got here uh, you know that I already explored that house over there and uh, you know that uh, there's still some exploring to do around here and we're gonna do that right now um, so, I guess this is a good time to talk about, uh, the craziness, uh, that has been going on, um, with, uh, Fallout 76. Uh, before Christmas, I received, uh, quite a few, uh, messages from you guys, and I really appreciate it, uh, um, letting me know that, uh, there was some kind of hack out there that allowed other people to uh, steal all your stuff just basically by looking at you and running a script. That is craziness, man. Um, I luckily had already recorded a bunch of episodes uh, for uh, when I was gone on my Christmas break, so uh, I did not play the game during that whole fiasco, and my understanding is that everything's okay now. Um, oh, there's something new. Um, it is, let's see, right now it is December... 30th as I'm recording this and my understanding is that the issue is fixed. I sure hope it is I'm still gonna be kind of wary of other people as I play uh, I feel kind of safe down here. Not too many walk people walk around down here. Here's a dude over here um, If I notice anybody getting close, I'll probably I don't know leave the game maybe uh, because that hack that exploit that they had uh, they have to be uh, within visual distance of you to steal your stuff is my understanding so um, so if I suddenly exit the game well you'll know why uh, so before I started this episode I uh, spent a little bit of time trying to manage my inventory and you know me I have so much fun with inventory and I stupid me I balked up uh, a bunch of my aluminum and sold it off and I should not have done that uh, because I need to uh, repair my favorite weapon um, and I need aluminum for that and so right now the only thing that I have marked to search for is aluminum so that's what I'm looking for I'm looking for aluminum but we're also doing some exploring here too so we're gonna walk back over here to this house and I'm just gonna take a quick look in here and see if there is any aluminum in here for me Aluminum cans or whatever. Apparently, aluminum is kind of hard to come by. Uh, I don't don't see it very much. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any in here. Doghouse here. A little shack over here. Look in here real quick. See if there's anything interesting in here. Uh, some paint cans. They don't have aluminum. I always pick up duct tape. Okay, so in that direction is a mine. Uh, that's Big Bun Tunnel East. We've already just explored that. Um, now, I remember... 
when I was exploring this area, uh, there was some things that were showing up on my map that uh, appeared to be unexplored or undiscovered before, but uh, I'm not seeing them on my map now. That's kind of crazy, that craziness that you saw in the that piece of that episode I just plugged in here. Uh, I'm not seeing any new stuff here, so I guess what we'll do is we're going to walk out here in this direction. I'm not sure why I have this marked here and not here. But uh, we're going to walk in this direction. I'm, I don't remember. I didn't go back and watch my um, video that I just spliced in here. So I don't really remember why I have this location marked. We're going to walk in this direction. Oh, maybe that's why. Yes. Uh, because in this direction is something else that we haven't discovered yet. And it is. it looks like one of those uh, silos or something maybe. Oh, there's even something else over in that direction. There's the, a house that this lost home, and then there's a tree over there too. So there's still still some things to explore out here, which is always exciting. It's my favorite thing to do, don't you know? Man, I sure do hope that that exploit is fixed. That is just crap, man. It's amazing that somebody can write a script to just steal another player's inventory. Just, I saw some videos of people doing it, and I mean, it, they steal the clothes right off their back, man. Just go straight to their underwear. Uh, there's something in here. A diseased, bloated, glowing one. Oh, he's fast. Oh, he is very fast. No, not him. Okay. There we go, got him. Kill a glowing creature, okay. So this place is pretty lousy with ghouls, it looks like. Here comes one rushing at us now. Lost home, this place is called. Hear me pressing my button for vats. What you got glowing when you got anything good on you? A Meyer treasure map number two. Um, That one does not look familiar to me, so I'm going to guess that that is one that I haven't seen before. Um, I don't think I want any of this other stuff. Oh, whoops, okay. I hate these trenches. Ugh. They're just a pain in the butt to try to get out of. Make it difficult to walk around. I don't like them. Sometimes you could find little bridges here that people have uh, crafted. So I wonder why this place is called Lost Home. And that direction is another one of those stupid groves. I think they're called... Um, yeah, Veiled Sundew Grove. I call them stupid because why are they there? I mean, we've seen two of them in the game so far. And um, I have explored them, but I don't know, nothing terribly interesting in them. Uh, I don't like them. I don't like them at all. And so I'm not happy that I'm seeing another one here. Man, I want some aluminum, man. I gotta fix my weapon. Excuse me, sir. I'd like to look beyond you there. Oh, well, whatever. An old wagon here. So, I mean, if this was a home, it's pretty crappy looking. What was that? Something they see that flash? Maybe I tripped something and this assault rifle was supposed to shoot at me. I don't know. Why did I just pick that up? I don't need that. Well, there's a power armor station here, which is kind of interesting. 
interesting looking rock there. Here's a, a brewing station. Power armor station, I could scrap that weapon I just picked up, and why not? Scrap my junk. See, it's one of those things This looks like a, there's a piece of paper you could pick up, but you can't. I don't want buff tats, I never take them, I just sell them. I want this crap. Little doghouse here. With a nice little painting of an elephant. I don't think I've seen that painting anywhere else in the game before. Huh. Kind of interesting, an interesting place. Oh, Requiem for Kelly. Let's play it. sad um do, do like sniper rifles and or weapons have aluminum in them it's possible right maybe not I don't know let's unlock this ammo box see what's inside of it I hear walking around I thought I heard footsteps If I did, Vats isn't picking anything up. Oh, I can only craft at a brewing station. No, oh, we could scrap here. Uh, some springs. That's what I get from it, huh? Springs. No, glass shards, steel scrap, and wood scraps. Oh, now it doesn't say springs. Whatever, I don't know what the hell's going on. Okay, it doesn't look like I got any um, aluminum. Oh, oh, somebody just pot purchased a bunch of shotgun shells. That's kind of cool. That's nice. I love when that happens. Withered feral ghoul here. I don't want any of that crap. Let's see what's in this little building here. A tin pitcher. Well, apparently that has aluminum in it, even though it's called a tin pitcher. Okay. Well, that was lost home. Let's go to this stupid place. Another one of these groves, I guess. Ah, oh, I didn't make the jump. 
Huh. There's a car down here. I wonder if it would be worth walking through all these... I don't even know what to call these... These... Recessed areas to see if there's anything interesting in them. Ugh. I just hate trying to jump over those. Oh yeah, remember these things? Sparse Sundew Grove. What? What is the freaking purpose of these places? Why? Why come here? What? What is it? What do I want from here? Giant pitcher plant? I don't know. I hate these places. I guess I hate them in large part because I don't really understand them. Why are they here? Am I supposed to be getting something useful from these places? Um. Safe, we can unlock it. This may take some time here. This is one of those level three ones. I'm getting nowhere with this one. Okay, better be something good in here. Uh, there's not. <laughs> uh, Red X, I guess, is worth taking. I mean, it's a neat effect. These things spewing stuff at you, but, um, boy, I sure don't like it. Giant pitcher plant. Harvest. Digested goo added. Is that something I want? Is that, is that worth collecting? Uh... Why would I? Why do I want it? What? What does it do for me? I don't know. So, yeah. Let's see over here. Whoa, weird. Kind of froze. Look at it. Now that's cool. <laughs> Everything froze in place for a moment. That was neat. There's a tank in here. Whoa. Scary. Contact scary. That was neat. Ooh, that was scary for a short moment there. Come running around from behind that. We have a situation here. Um, aluminum scrap. I'll take that. Dead guy here. I don't think I want any of this stuff. I think somebody bought fusion cells from me once before, I think. So why was a tank here in this grove? Doesn't seem like this would be a good place for a tank to be trying to travel through. Look at that, there's more of those frozen things there. It's kind of cool looking. It's like fireworks kind of frozen. Neat. But yeah, what was this tank coming after? Was it rolling towards Watoga and it got stuck here? I don't know. Let's just look around here a little bit more. See if we see anything interesting. Anything worth looking at. hear explosions faintly off in the distance. Always makes me wonder if there's other players around. Could be Data Smasher Prime. Data Smasher Prime over there? I don't know. It's kind of far away though. Somebody named Flatline over here. Uh, those um, spores, I'm going to call them spores, those glowing spewing things. They make it harder to see too, which is probably another reason I don't like walking around in these groves. 
But I mean, there's got to be a reason for these things, right? And it's and why do they freeze like that too? I have to think that's some kind of glitch, but it's a neat one. <laughs> it's really a cool effect. Well, um, yeah, off in the distance, there is some big time explosions going on. If I kept walking in that direction, we would end up back at Sunrise Field. But we've already been there, so let's turn around and walk in this direction. And um, we'll start walking in the direction of this uh, star within a circle that we see on our compass here. But, um, we'll do that in the next episode. I'm going to end this episode here. Let's just walk around just a little bit more. Just to see if there's anything cool in here. And then we'll end this episode. And then we'll start the next episode in this place or near this place. Depending upon where the game wants to put us. And we will start walking towards uh, what is probably another, another uh, missile site. Oh, interesting. Some medics here. A settler. Well, no wonder they're dead. All they had was a freaking 10 millimeter pistol. That's not going to do you a whole lot of good out here. I guess it's better than nothing. Maybe you could use it on yourself. I don't know. But uh, it's not going to be killing any creatures that are running around here. Even though we're not seeing any right now. Which is kind of interesting. It's very peaceful. Alright. Well, thank you guys for joining me on this episode, and thank you to everyone who uh, left me messages warning me about that um, inventory hack. Uh, I would not have known about it. Um, so I really appreciate you giving me the heads up so that uh, it did not happen to me. Looks like I'm thirsty again. Let's go ahead and take a drink of something before I forget. Need a little bit of food here, some potato crisps, and um, what else do I have that we could eat? I don't know, sugar bombs? That's a healthy meal. Those don't really do much for you though, do they? And some deviled eggs. Alright, we're all healthy. All ready for the next episode. Thank you guys for joining me on this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why don't you let me know, leave me a like or a comment. If you're not a subscriber, why not subscribe and then click the little bell icon so you're notified whenever I post a video. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next episode.